What was the worst birthday you ever had? Because I remember mine vividly. It was this year, June 2017, where I had the worst birthday of my life. See, at the time, I was diagnosed with acute bronchitis, but I did not know that yet. I wouldn't know until halfway through the month that I actually had that disease. And acute bronchitis, for those that do not know, is basically a sort of a dry drowning, where your lungs fill out with a lot of mucus, and uh, your pipes and everything for talking, they get really swelled up, and essentially you can't really talk a whole bunch, and you drink a lot of water because, again, you're dry drowning. It was the worst birthday I ever had in my entire life. I wasn't able to talk about E3 as much as I wanted. I wasn't able to do anything with family because of how bad it was. And overall, it was just a really, really crappy day. I say this because despite all that, despite getting sick, this year has been one of the best years of my life. And one of the reasons for that is because of everyone here on YouTube. I know 100 subscribers is not a lot for a lot of people, but for me this indicates that I've been growing very much as a person, as an entertainer, as a let's player, as a streamer, and overall content provider, if you want to get to that. A lot of this I have to thank for the reactions that I did, for like various things. Suffice to say, Reactions were not something that I thought I'd ever do because I felt it was kind of beneath me to tell truth. But the more and more I did reactions, the more and more I realized how fun they actually are and how very easy they are to do. And it's something that a lot of people I know actually like watching and seeing and doing these reactions and doing these videos and, and all that such make me very happy to do them. And it makes me happy that I grew because of that. They're not hard to make. People like watching them, and that's fine. A little disheartening that people don't watch the Let's Plays as much, but we're going to watch what they want. Not everyone wants to see Valkyrian Profile 2 coming up or, or uh, see a, a <laughs> game like Gradia uh, on, the, on the field. That's fine. People have only played oh so many games, and I have oh so many games that I want to play. Meanwhile, reactions are a very easy bit to swallow. And I very much would like to dive into more content that's a little more scripted than my usual off-the-cuff like I'm doing right now. Because mainly, that's what I do do. I, I do off-the-cuff stuff. I don't really talk too much on a scripted format. And going into the future, I would like to go further into that. But just saying these things to y'all is not enough of just actually doing it. And I do promise you I, I'm working on things, but that promise means very little when there's no content to actually show for it. Regardless, I am very happy that everyone is here that watches my content and interacts with me in any sort of way. I'd like to thank uh, two people especially, Copy Left, for uh, commenting on my YouTube videos. And uh, Mr. Fobles for being in my streams as much as he has been over these past few years. I also like to thank my editor, McCaggles, or Michael, as, as he prefers to be called every now and again. I like to thank McCaggles for doing as much editing as he has been doing and pretty much doing it for rather cheap in comparison to what I should be paying him. And I hope to pay him further and further along in the future with more money and have him actually come one of my bigger editors. I'd also like to thank Skippy-san uh, for being a very good partner to actually play games with and in general just do some of the thumbnails that you see here throughout this video. I'd also like to thank Platinum Speed for a lot of things, numerous things help get things going. Uh, they are essentially the ones that perpetuated this whole entire thing into motion where I started making LPs and uh, eventually reactions and all the other stuff that I've been doing uh, in the most zanious of ways. I also started doing uh, 
a, a stream channel with them where basically we just stream uh, with each other, a bunch of games and whatnot. It's pretty fun. If y'all want to check it out, it's, it's called Transmission for um, dumb reasons, pun reasons. And most of all, I would like to thank you fans out there that have been watching my stuff and the viewers out there that have been watching my stuff and even passerbys that just click on one video literally look at this and just like I'll save it for later maybe thank you all so much for at least looking at my channel and giving my giving me a, a try and whatnot and it's just it's lovely to see more and more views every day having to all my videos and I hope that this hundred could expand and could get exponentially bigger but at the very least in the back of my mind I know I have an audience now and a hundred is just a milestone it's not at all it's just a cool little thing a little thing to note but what really matters the most is that y'all are actually watching the stuff I'm putting out and I'm seeing it through the analytics and whatnot and it makes me very happy that the things that I do put out are being watched. Because when you put these things out on YouTube in the very beginning, you don't see that a lot. You don't see the growth instantaneously. And with YouTube being the way that it is, being as accessible as it is, it's really hard and really trying when you're just starting out and you have like 20 subs. And it's just like... It's getting like so little views. But you persevere and you move on because this is something that you want to do because you love this so much and for anyone out there that's that may think about getting into YouTube may think about making videos and whatnot it very much is a passion project in the very beginning it very much is and I don't know how much money I'll make off this later on down the road I don't know if I'll make any sort of living but that's the the goal here that's the dream but this is all fueled by one thing and one thing only. That I really like video games. I like playing them. I like talking about them. I like interacting with other people about them. I like collecting them. I like seeing the prices go down. I like seeing the prices go up when then I have the actual game itself. It's such a fascinating thing to me. Games are. Just the stories that they tell, the things that they do. It's just... No other media has caught me this way in comparison to anything else and there's nothing more that I like to talk about more than video games because they're my life essentially there's something that I like to keep doing over and over again and something that I do want to keep doing because I just really love video games so while the future of this channel is still gonna be me trying to make more scripted videos and uh, get more stuff out there as, as much as possible this will always be mainly a gaming channel because I love games so much. But that's not to say that I don't want to hear any of y'all feedback about things. I would love to have more interactions with y'all, have more polls out there for you to vote on, and things like that. I understand not everyone out there is gonna like do that right away or it's gonna happen like immediately. But it is something that I want to work on and I would love to improve on. But overall, with this channel, I want to get better and better for it. Because at least a hundred people out there uh, looked at my channel and went sub. <laughs> That's so odd to me. I never really thought this would be the case. Either way, I really do look forward to making this channel better and better. Thank you all for watching. Y'all really made this year for me. And y'all 100 subs out there, technically 103 as of this moment, y'all make it that much more real that things will get better. I'm very happy for that. Thank you again for subscribing to this channel. <laughs>